Hey everybody, so today we wanted to take a look at the settings area of the software. Uh, this is an important feature to understand. It controls a lot of the environmental settings of the Bobcat system. So let's just go to File, and then we're going to go to Settings. And this dialog box will come up, and there's a couple of tabs here. There's the System tab, uh, Document Defaults, and Current Documents. Uh, the current document tab will update settings for the file that you're working on. Uh, default uh, document will be, as you create new files, uh, those will be the default settings. Uh, the areas we want to look at here is your units, so you can default your units. When it comes to display, you can change things like your background color or selection color, uh, your shading quality, uh, how your user coordinate system is displayed, uh, selection sensitivity. You also have different options like the tolerances for CAD, uh, default snap increments, uh, default uh, text, default point styles. Um, when you get into the cam here, you also have a, a couple of settings as well, the default cam tolerances and some of the machining order. Uh, by using the settings dialog, you can default uh, common settings for whether it's your unit or environment. So this way, as you create new files, uh, they'll be uh, established with the settings that you feel are best for your shop. Now, if you're new to Bobcat and you're not sure if you need to adjust any of these settings, I would just leave them all defaulted. And uh, if there comes a scenario where it needs to be updated uh, or customized, you can always speak with the support team. Uh, one of the things that I do like that they did about the version 32 that is noteworthy is you can take settings from a current document that you have open and you can uh, you can click apply to default so that will capture the current settings of the file that you're working with and then default it and you also have the ability to uh, reverse it the other way where you can open up a file uh, maybe that was sent from another customer and you can click uh, apply to document so that will apply your default settings to that document <laughs>